right, so here he is, the number one heavyweight contender, making the walk to the octagon here tonight. He is challenging the champion, whom he has bad blood with, whom he believes he is better than. And obviously, as he makes the walk here tonight, he finally has the chance to prove that he and not the champion is the man who deserves the distinction as the baddest man on the planet. As he makes his way towards his cage, he believes this is his time. He believes he is destined to take this title. His preparation for this bout has gone absolutely according to plan. He's in fantastic shape with a great game plan, and he expects to walk out of his cage tonight as the new champion. So here he is making his way to the Octagon for another heavyweight title defense. This has been the baddest man on the planet now for several years, and he has taken on all comers more often than not, leaving them twitching on the canvas. Knockout power for days. The question is tonight, with a challenge like this, can he walk out the way he came in? as the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world. The champion is in focus right now. He's making his way towards the cage. His training for this bout has been perfect. Everything ran according to plan. He believes he has a solid game plan, and he's ready to step in here and retain his title. Tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. More than five years apart with similar height and reach. And now for the particulars, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Mario Yamasaki. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out arena in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Heavyweight Championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands by feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 255 pounds. Fighting out of New York, introducing the challenger, And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Tokyo, Japan, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Hercules. Championship out. I want you guys to do a clean fight. Follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Good luck tonight. Touch gloves. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a hey, long go, time. And it is gonna go down go, right now. Damaging strike there. <laughs> Missed the mark. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful kick to the body. Tags him with the left, Joe. <laughs> Trying to hammer that lead leg. Nice. Splits the guard and connects with the punch. Landed that punch flush. Oh! Fainting. Well, he moved right into that straight punch, Joe. Left the body wide open, and his opponent wisely took advantage. Let's see if he adjusts here moving forward. 
much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. And there he swung with a oh. haymaker. And Chance is in big trouble. He's in deep danger right now. Who saw this coming? He's got him hurt here. Under three minutes now to go in round one. There was a nice exchange. How about that chin? There it is. Oh, elbow beautiful there. elbow. Side control again. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Oh, he's got double underhooks here in the clinch. Good spot to be. Tying up in the clinch here. He moves to the Muay Thai clinch. Right hand lands flush there, Joe. And he's looking for that left. Oh, beautiful, beautiful right hand by the champion. Oh, solid jab. That's oh, a that hard a hook. Big hook. We'll see if he can follow it up. Oh, that head kick landed. One minute to go. All right, 45 seconds now to go on the way. That strike will count. Ah, missed on that one, Joe. Oh, is he a good counter striker? Counters beautifully with the left hand. Cannot get it. 15 seconds to go. That one hurt. Second oh, round, straight oh. ahead. Let's see some of the action here. Here we see some beautiful striking and perfect timing on this punch. And here's a devastating blow that almost ends this fight. Big round. Great round. Come on, have a seat. Have a seat. You're not tired. You're not tired. Look at him. He's breathing hard. Brittany Palmer is in the building. Uppercut misses. Oh! The kick gets through. Misses a huge hook to the head. Okay, he's got nice snap to that left leg. Very nice. Oh. He's, he's hurt. Well, he has landed some good shots tonight, Joe, but as yet, he has been unable to string together any solid combinations, and that has served to keep his opponent in this fight. So let's see if he can change up the tempo a little bit with his strikes and try to put together a combination that is more damaging to his opponent. Nice inside like you can telegraph. Oh, we heard him again. He's hanging on here, but he is in big, big trouble. Nice job moving off the center line. He slips to avoid that right hand. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Now goes in and secures the takedown. It looks like he may be going for a submission. He got out of the triangle. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Trying to pass there, but he gets stopped. And he winds up on top. Under two minutes to go in our second round. He's working some half guard now. And busy as he looks to improve position here. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. 
Back to side control. All right, so he just decides to get up here, Joe. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive than we saw in round one, and now starting to find himself in the pocket. Whoa! He's got to be careful here. Just missed with the left there. Oh! Body kick to that. How about that chin? Inside leg kick is good. 15 seconds. Nice. Oh, another one. What a round. Oh, how about the end of that round? He got knocked down just before the horn, saved by the bell. So now back to the stool. He has only 60 seconds to recover. We'll see if physically he can keep himself in this fight. And here, a perfectly placed punch results in a knockdown. And let's look at it from a different angle. The beautiful Jenny Andrade to get us going. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. That last round. Oh! Whoa! It's very wobbly. He's trying to hang on. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Oh! Let me show you the total strikes. Powerful right leg kick. Oh, he is wearing it. Bleeding from his cheek now, Joe. Oh! He's out! Beautiful shot to end the fight here. Outstanding knockout. Yeah, Joe, just the way he drew it up as he gets the knockout victory here tonight, it's hard to land a strike more flush than he did right there, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming. So he'll see the replay and probably shake his head, but ultimately this is a huge result and a huge win for that fighter here tonight. And here's the end. Let's take a look at it again from a different angle. Look at the power in this right hand as it lands. Picture perfect for the knockout. Check it out again. Right on the button. So the celebration is on for the UFC heavyweight champion of the world, the baddest man on the planet, and your winner, yes, by knockout here tonight. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is called to stop to this contest at one minute, four seconds of the third round. Playing the winner by knockout and new undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world. Iron. So some UFC history tonight as we crown a new UFC champion. Congratulations to fighter and team. And man, are they going to enjoy this one. A lot of people not giving them a chance coming in here tonight. And this is a moment that at times people just thought we wouldn't see. New champion here tonight. The longtime incumbent is out. There is a new sheriff in town in this division, and it is going to take a big performance to dethrone the new champion of this weight class.